It's my favorite time of the month. Time to give a special thank you to all my supporters at the Fabled Survivor Elite Tier. You can join the Fabled Survivor Elite Tier on YouTube or Patreon. Links are in the description. You guys are the best. Thank you so much for helping make our dreams come true. Autumn, Sylvie, and I love you all very much. You people rock. What's up, Zombie Slayers? Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is KJ48, and welcome back to Seven Days to Die, and it tastes like brass. Well, what what tastes like brass? What are you talking about? I drank some Grandpa's Awesome Sauce. I also took some Sugar Butts, and then I went to Trader 3, okay? Trader 3 had a sledge, sledge turret that I took apart, and I got three robotics parts out of it. Now that I have three robotics parts, and along with... These robotics parts, I should be able to make a drone. Okay, so there we go. Alright, so we just need steel, duct tape, polymer, motion sensors. I didn't think this thing would take four motion sensors. That's, um, that's a lot. That's a lot. Well, I already have one, so we're gonna need iron. Oh, they're pretty cheap. Yeah, they're pretty cheap. So we're gonna need some iron. Oh, forge. Oh, we got more iron, right? Yep, I thought so. Okay, we'll take that as well. Let's do a little bit of organ. Actually, we're not going to be doing a little bit of organizing. We need to get done with this and get out there because we're running out of daylight and I would like to do another quest today. All right, so what else am I going to need? Mechanical parts, right? Is that everything for the motion sensors? Yep, one, two, three. All right, so we got 44 seconds on them. Uh, while I was at Trader 3, he also had Pistol Pete. Uh, he had also had a Pistol Pete 2 book. Each successive leg shot, same target, increased the chance to cripple. So that's pretty cool. And uh, then we got that. And then we just need the drone. Uh, yep, we're just waiting for the motion sensors. Two more. And then we're going to make the drone. And then we're going to get out and about. I um, Yeah, I really want to really get out and do some questing. I also have an SMG I need to make. But I, I wanted the drone because he's going to have a lot of storage for me. Uh, the SMG, we could, we could put that on hold for another night. We'll make it, um, we'll make it tonight in-game. Uh, I don't know about this video, but... Definitely tonight in game. I'm going to need some boiled meat as well. Because food is not optimal what I'm doing right now. Okay, craft. Two minutes and 36 seconds. Let's do it. All right, check this out. Drone. Modify. Boom. Love it. Love it. Now, hopefully this thing won't dupe as much as it used to, but we'll see. And there we go. And my drone has that much extra space. That much extra space. Um, I could make her silent, but honestly, sometimes she brings to my attention there's zombies in the area that I didn't know about, and that's pretty valuable, you know? If a zombie's trying to sneak up on me, my drone's like, hey, Cage, zombie, sneaking up on you. I'm like, oh, whoa, okay, there we go. Looking good. So, uh, if she gets annoying, though, I will silence her, but we'll see. I'm sure she'll be fine. I'm sure she will be just fine. All right, let's do this. Oh, I didn't even notice that. <laughs> it just popped right back in there. All right, drone. Shh, be quiet, drone. I'm not gonna go super sneaky on this one. I'll I'll sneak a little bit, but I probably won't sneak as much. Doing a lot of sneaking lately. Incoming enemies, prepare for conflict. Shut up. She can't wake them up, can she? I might have to silence her if she can wake them up. She didn't wake that guy up. Oh, crap. I forgot to bring more arrows. Damn it. All right, whatever. It's fine. It'll be fine. What do we got in here? All right. I will take that. Not seeing any zombies down here. See it? See it? Coffee's, coffee makes got coffee in it? Nope. Mm, nope, that's okay. Honestly, I don't really use coffee as much in the POIs. I use it more when I'm mining. It's invaluable. Ooh, that's nice. It's invaluable when I'm mining, though. Invaluable? What, that, does that make sense? Like, it's so... No, the invaluable is probably the wrong way to say that. Whatever. It's super valuable. I don't know. Invaluable sounds right, but it doesn't make any sense when I'm thinking about it. Uh, can't hit the head. Yeah, I can. Thread the needle. Damn it! Shit. Can I get him here? 
Oh, come on, stupid chairs. Oh, didn't see this guy. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what's up with the... And of course I messed up the chairs, so now I can't pick them up. Doesn't matter. I'm a freaking ninja. Oh my goodness. Alright, at least I can get my arrows back. I might as well stay ducked. Even if I'm going to move fast, I move really fast while ducked. Is there any reason not to duck? Well, if I'm running away. My senses have picked up something. Okay. Yeah, they have. Alright. And there you go. <clears throat> I wish there was a book that made it so your headlight, you know, your, your helmet light doesn't attract attention. Because I really like to use it. There you are. Oh boy. Easy there. Alright. Let's start moving now. Oh. Yep. 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 This is the way. What the hell is that? Is that you, drone? You making noise back there? Right, let's go up this way. Oh boy, we got some birds! We got some birds, baby! There we go. Two less birds. Let's kind of look over here. Look if there's anything over there. We gotta go this way. Right? It's gotta be down here. Oh, okay. I remember this place now. I hate this building. <clears throat> Although, the more you do it, the more you'll, like, learn it, so... What the hell happened to the thing that I had here? Why did I take the axe out of that spot? Oh, to put the drone down. Okay, fair enough. I was worried. I was like, did I scrap something? I wasn't supposed to. <laughs> oh, that's not bad to sell. Okay. Okay, so. I've got a bad there you are. Remember that guy? I remember. <laughs> Slice him a couple more times. Just just your good measure. Ammo box. Oh, that is nice. I don't need any of that stuff, but still, it's good stuff. All right, what you got for me? Paper. I guess we could start taking paper. Eh, it's not bad. Get some plastic. Close that. Grab the TV. Come on, buddy. Yeah, come get some of this bad medicine. How you like me now? Man, my freaking voice, dude. I'm just getting over being sick. Uh, nothing in here. A little trash. Can't loot that. I don't bother with the with the toilets. Alright, that's probably the way we have to go, and I think I have to go down if I remember. Anything in here? I feel like there should be some zombies hiding in here somewhere. Yet I'm not seeing any. So the nice thing is now I can start taking like pretty much everything. You know? I'll scrap a few things, but what is it? What is this? Iron arrowheads? Yeah, hold on to those. But now that I have a drone. I could just carry so much more. As a matter of fact, I should move probably most of my healing items onto my drone. Alrighty. Um, like I said, I think I'm, I think I'm supposed to go down. Yep. I definitely woke something up. I don't know what from where. Oh, from there. That's what I figured. Oh, he, he died to bleeding, didn't he? And then I cut his head off for no reason. Uh oh. What do we have here? Some dukes. Hello. Hey, now. None of that. We don't need any of that. Start taking paper for no reason, I guess. If I have the room, I might as well. Oh, yes. Yes. That was meat, right? Meat stew. Ah, potatoes. Okay. So I have my other recipe takes potatoes as well. So um, not really that great, but still. Nice to, get, nice to get something like that. already have that. 
and it looks like just about everything. Oh, okay. Down you go. I don't even have to keep my my helmet light on because it's um it's daytime. So anybody else above me? I don't know. I guess I'll I'll find out eventually. Let's check the um the loot stage seventy. Okay. Fair enough. Uh, nobody else in here. Okay. Got a purse. Someone left their purse on the counter. All right, I think we're going to transfer some stuff now. And there we go. Beautiful. And this is what the drone's looking like. Pretty cool. And that's me like, not getting rid of anything. Master, we are not alone. Now, did, did the drone wake up? Uh, guys, I need to know. Is the drone going to wake up the zombies or not? Because, I don't know. I, might, I, I think the drone says something once the zombies... Yeah, look, right there. Not saying anything. I think the drone says something once they actually wake up. So I should be okay. Yeah, because this one's right next to me. Yeah, okay. It's when they wake up. Which is what I was hoping. Alright. Loot it up. 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 Coffee. Grinds. Is that grinds or beans? Okay, good. I was going to say, yeah, co coffee grinds is like when you already made the coffee. So I'm not a coffee guy, by the way. I went ahead and wrenched a bunch of stuff. Uh, am I supposed to break into there? No, that's the place I just was. Yeah. Might actually broke through that door last time I was here. Oh, there you are. There you go. Bleed on that. Oh, boy. I've got a bad feeling about okay. Yeah, it's funny. You know you're doing well. By the time your drone says she, she's got a bad feeling about it, you've already dispatched the zombies. Um, one thing, that, so th there's been a lot of talk in this game, the difference between heavy and light armor. Um, I generally <clears throat> have always been a proponent of heavy armor because I'm going to get hit and I'd like to just take less damage when I do. Um, the thing is, light armor is nice because you don't get hit too many times in a row. You might get hit once and it's going to hurt, but usually you're not going to get hit multiple times because you're going to back out, back out of there. Whoa. Uh, I don't think I was, I don't think that was supposed to happen. I think I just woke up the, the end guys, like the, the end part of the, the, yeah, that wasn't supposed to happen. Are they going to make it to me or? All right. Well, I guess we'll just do it this way. Yeah. Th this is the end part of the, um, of the POI and I got too close to the enemies and they, and they woke up. Uh, maybe it's the end part. It, Kind of looks like it might not be the end part, but it kind of looks like the end part. And I don't know where the other guys went, but I gotta watch out for them because half the half the group just ran off. Okay, and there we go. Oh, you think? What makes you think that? Okay, I definitely hear some more out there. Oh, here they are. Oh, that's quite a few of them. I think we're gonna go with some guns. Here, let's use our new gun today. Oh, we just woke up a bunch more zombies, didn't we? Alright, whatever. Okay, so it looks like they got to me somehow. Alright, that's fine. Doing alright. See, we got maneuverability. And you are a punk ass. All right, we haven't gone loud in quite a while, so this is fun. All right, cool. All right, so that was, that was a lot of guys right there. <laughs> All right, I guess we're just going to go big for the rest of the map. The hell with it. To hell with it. What is out here? Oh. So they put these secret areas here. you think they'd put something really good in them. Right? But they're usually just trash. So it's like, why make a secret area like that and then put a, a bag of trash back there? You know, that doesn't seem to make any sense. Is there anything to loot down here? Uh, I'm not really seeing anything. All right, fine. Let's come up here and loot. Get some super water. 
That's not stupid. You can keep that trash. All right. And that looks like just about it. Um, I've got a lot of wrenching ahead of me, though. So, <laughs> no time like the present. All right. So, let's keep on keeping on. And I'm actually not going to go loud the rest of the... I mean, if I have to go loud, I'll go loud. But I'm still going to try and sneak a little bit Incoming here. Enemies. Prepare for oh, that didn't work out. Oh, it kind of worked out. I'm trying to let my health come back, but... Oh. Oh. Interesting. Yeah, I'm trying to let my health come back, but these freaking zombies keep hitting me. Might have to heal. Uh, well, I could probably eat that pie, and that's going to give me some health, so let's do that. Alright, we've got in this bag. Sweet F all. So, oh, okay, I know where I am. How have I not killed everything? I, You know, there might be... I bet you there's still some zombies down below. Yeah, I can almost guarantee it. Alright. Oh, we need to find a way for supplies, too. I haven't even been thinking about it. Alright, well, it is what it is. Alright, let's go down here quietly. Yep, right there is where I was fighting. So if those... No. Oh. I think they're all dead down here. Unless they haven't all spawned. You know, they might not spawn until I actually come down here. Hmm. Alright, I'm not really sure. Yep, yeah, this is the um, end loot room. And this is where all the zombies came through. But I must have missed something. Because there's definitely some zombies that aren't dead. So I gotta find them. And I gotta find White River Supplies. All right, there we go. Grab this. I will scrap the nails. Okay, well, let's see if we can find these guys. All right, I found where the last zombies are. And the um, White River supplies are right up here as well. There's a way to get up there. It's a little bit more elegant, I guess, but whatever, I got the job done. All right, so we're gonna come through here and there's gonna be a way to get on the roof. And right there are some zombies. I don't know if you saw them, but it's a little tricky to get up here all right it's weird i think he broke out of here and then walked back because he couldn't find me it's the only thing i could think of i don't know what the hell he's done. like he's kind of broken out here but this is weird oh okay so yeah that's how i get to the white river supplies okay fair enough check the roof we're running out of time here so uh i'm not seeing anything on radar Still not cleared? What the ever-loving heck? Yeah, I- oh. My have picked up something. Oh, he was supposed to fall through the- oh, I see. Do you see I was supposed to walk along this? And zombies would fall through the- the ceiling. Hold on. Let's go over here. Alright, looks like there's one right there. Yeah, they're- they're kind of- I don't know, they're spawning kind of weird today. I'm not really sure. Let's go this way. And go this way. Nope, I've never, I haven't been here yet. That's what it is. They're spawning fine, I just haven't gone to the right places. And there we go. Okay, cool. Let's go turn this quest. You guys thought I was going to forget the end loot, didn't you? Well, to be fair, I kind of did. Um, I was just on my way out. And, like, the way out, like, the POIs, like, go to the end. But usually at the end, there's a door you can open to get out so you don't have to backtrack through the POI. And because I was going that way, I just happened to stumble upon this. And uh, now I'm breaking 50 lockpicks for it, but that's okay. All right, let's see what we got in here. Uh, first of all, let's throw stuff, some stuff up in here. We'll scrap that. I really don't need to be carrying glass. Like, seriously... Do not need to be carrying glass, but we could throw the rest of the stuff up there. Not the lockpicks. Okay, that should be plenty of room. All right, let's do some looting. Mm -hmm. Okay. And you, my friend, Savage Country. All right, not bad. Mo Power Electronics. All right, and for the big boy. All right. So we got that. Um, yeah, that's not that bad. That's not that bad at all. 
Make some money. We got something for our bow. Uh, although, well, what does it do? Uh, accuracy. This is 20. Yeah, I don't care about damage to animals. There we go. All right, we got to go turn this quest, man, because we are almost at the end here. So this is the switch. And this brings us right outside. Cool. All right, let's go turn this in. All right, quest reward time. Don't spend it all in one if you're Oh, yes. Yes. Oh, the military work. gloves, too. Oh. oh, the steel shovel's like whatever, but I could have made some money off of it. Well, it's only blue. All right, I'm going with the comp compound crossbow. Oh, I did not expect this. 500 concrete blocks. Sniper rifle bundle, bundle is crap for me. I don't. If that's not something I need. Battery bag bundle, not something I need. Blade trap bundle, pretty good. Food bundle would be nice. All right, here's the deal with these concrete blocks, man. If you put them down in the wrong spot, it's going to be painful. But I can always sell them back, too. Is the sell price for the whole stack 300 That's a good question. But if I'm careful, that could be a really good building block. I'm going to take this. I'm gonna take this special jobs, open I trade route. Got a job or two. This is dangerous work. And let's take another jab. You need some work? I need some commission. Oh, well. uh, let's Check see. Back soon. Yeah, Maybe we'll have something for you. We're gonna be doing a building episode next episode, probably, so we won't do restore power. We um, need someone to handle the. Time. Yeah, courthouse. Hurry courthouse sounds soon, good. And I'll have a nice reward for you. And then right here, we will uh, grab everything we can. Let me organize because there's gonna be some stuff I'm gonna want to sell. So for anyone that was wondering, um, these things sell 20 per uh, 20 for 12. So if I sold the whole thing, it would be 312. I'm not going to sell it. Um, but when I build with these concrete blocks, I'm going to be very careful. I could use these for walls. Uh, the Bloodbath and Beyond has big walls. And uh, actually, I probably won't use it for... I don't know what I'm going to use it for, but I'm going to use it for something. Uh, and I'll just be careful with it. All right. So let's go ahead and repair this. And then we... Sell, 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 sell. Keep that puffer coat. I don't know if I have another one or not. We don't need rifle parts, money, machine gun parts. Okay. We've already gone over all our stuff. I don't think there's anything on here I really care about at this point. Um. Well, maybe I didn't buy some of this stuff. No, I did. No, she's good. Oh, yeah, I sold it. Okay. Yeah, I think we're good there. All right, let's see what we got in here. All right, very good. I like that stuff. Let's get back to base and unload our bounty. I am nice and organized now, and I want to do a couple things before we end the video. First of all, I'd like to talk about those blocks I took. Um, I don't even know where I put them, to be honest. I think I put them, yeah, right there. All right, I'm going to work with these, but I'm going to be very careful. All right, they're going to be for Bloodbath and Beyond com compound, and I will have to put them down very carefully because these won't be the blocks surrounding the outside. I guess they could be. Maybe I'll put them surrounding the outside. It'd be easier to put them down as full blocks on the outside of Bloodbath and Beyond than it would be to intricately get into the kill zone and turn them into poles. Once you start turning things into poles and you're not 100% on your building, it's not a good idea to use this stuff for that. So I won't use it for that, but I will use it for the outside parts because um, it's all going to be concrete at some point anyway. All right, so what I would like to do now is I would like to do some cooking. So let's take a look. Let's put that up there. And let's take a look at the food we can make. So we got hobo stew, which takes potatoes, and meat stew, which also takes potatoes. Same amount of potatoes, and potatoes is what's, you know, holding me back, okay? Now, I don't rem I don't know what these give you, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you. Like, these don't tell you what they give you, which is kind of annoying. Um, so we've got meat stew and hobo stew. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to press F1, type CM, which is command menu or something like that. Um, and then I'm going to do stew. And then I'm going to look at meat stew. Oh, yeah, you don't have to spawn it in. Okay. I'm going to look at meat stew. 50 food. And then I'm going to look at hobo stew. Um, 64. Okay, so hobo stew gives you more food. Okay. So let's just make sure it's turned off. It is. So, we're, yeah, we're going to do hobo stew. So flesh, potatoes, corn, animal fat, and water. Uh, flesh... Potatoes, animal fat, animal fat, and water. I think that's everything I needed for it. Oh, 12. Wow, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. 
That's a really good. That's a really good cook right there, Jesse. We gotta cook. And I, honestly, yeah, yeah, it was okay. No, yeah, that that is really cool. I love that. That's gonna feed me for quite a long time. That is really, really nice. Okay, the next thing I would like to do before we end the video is start making some oil. All right, oil has been holding me back, so we're gonna need empty cans and oil shell. All right, empty cans. There they are. An oil shale. We don't have a ton of oil shale. We're gonna need it for gas. Let's go. Let's go outside and see how much gas we have first of all in our motorcycle because, I mean, really we need gas more than oil. We need oil, but we can't run out of gas to get oil. It looks like we got a lot of gas though. All right, so the gas tank is filled up. We still got five thousand gas. That is plenty of gas. Yeah, look at that moon. The sky in this game looks really good. I, I don't often look at it, but. Yeah, that looks, that's a really good looking sky. I'm not gonna lie. Good job, Fun Pimps. Alright, so let's come over here and put this in here. And do we wanna make 21? Oh, that's only 500 oil shale? Wow. Alright, you know what we need? We need more cans. So I do wanna start making cans in here, but I'd have to cook stuff in there in order to be able to make cans. So what would I like to cook in there? Uh, we'll cook some iron. Sounds pretty good. There we go, and we'll do this. And we can make 93 cans. That doesn't seem crazy. You know, let's just go to make 93 cans. And in the meantime, I will start some oil here. Alright, so that's gonna need 10. We'll go uh let's do that. I know I, I know I end up putting more fuel in here, but that's okay. It's not worth my time to be dicking around with it. Alright, so I'm gonna let the cans cook up and then I'm gonna make All even shut up, you. Help. I'm going to wait for the cans to cook up. I'm going to make even more oil. Um, right here, I have uh, cement, and we're looking pretty good. Uh, I reserve the right to change my mind at any time, but as of right now, I am planning to do a building episode next episode. So we'll have to see how that goes. Anyway, guys, if you end up enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.